Hey guys, this is Muffin Design and today I'm going to help you convert your Mac only external hard disk into a Windows compatible external hard disk. Mac supports HFS Plus which is known as Mac OS extended file system. That's why they are not, uh, that's why Mac only external hard disks are not seen in uh, Windows PC or are not compatible with Windows PC. Windows supports FAT32 or NTFS file system. So the external hard disks need to be in those file uh, formats. Mm. Uh, the hard disk would be detected but would not show in your Windows PC so you can't transfer data. Today I have a transcend uh, storage at 302 terabyte in capacity which has a Thunderbolt port and a USB port. You can use either for connection with PC if your PC has Thunderbolt, Thunderbolt port prefer that. So I have co I'm connecting the hard disk with my PC now. As you can see it is not detected in my computer anywhere. Here, as you can see, not detected. It uh, 82 terabyte in capacity. There should be 1.81 uh, uh, usable space. So now, what we can uh, we need to convert this hard disk into a Windows compatible f file format. For that, we will use a software called AOMEI Partition Manager. Let me boot it up. Wait, okay, I'm booting it up now. AOMEI partition manager, any version would do, but latest is preferred. So as you can see, we can see the um, transcend storage at here, 1.81 other file format. So just delete the partition, uh, even the FAT16 one and the other uh, partition, de just delete them. Then you will have 1.81 unallocated space. Just uh, right click on them, create a partition in AOMEI partition manager and uh, choose NTFS or FAT32 file format for uh, external hardware I will go for a NTFS file format and just click apply to apply all these changes which you have done otherwise they won't show so see as you can see now the drive uh, would be converted into NT uh, 1.81 TB of NTFS file format okay now just apply it will take some time if you have a fast system with good configuration it will take a less time it also depends upon the transfer rate because the uh, hard disk is formatted uh, doesn't take more than two one or two minutes so pretty easy all these steps can be followed by everyone and these are pretty easy to use so let's check as you can see we can see the 1.81 terabyte hard disk external hard disk now it is it was a mac only hard disk now it is compatible with windows uh, if you want to convert it back to mac again you have to use hfs plus uh, file system i will show that in some other video so uh, as you can see you just need to delete the partition create a new partition in ntfs file format and just apply the changes it's that simple if you have other method to convert such hard disks, please mention them in the comment, uh, comment section below. I would love to know them and apply in my day to day life or show, show other people how to use it. So guys, like, subscribe and share and have a great day.